Yo, what's going on YouTube? It is OG and we are back. So, uh, you know, a bit of an absence the past week, but guys, I have been working for a YouTube video. So as you guys can see on the screen, we got the 2KB, which I promise you guys, I had to make sure I came through with this one. Honestly, there's a lot of times I want to quit. I don't think it was like a hard push, but uh, it was like 30 minute matchmaking pretty much every game since like 1700 so when you lost it felt really bad but i did it uh, with my buddies pika and lukey and they definitely made it a lot easier and they're just nuts at their brothers too so uh shout out to pika and lukey for the carries and uh unfortunately guys i couldn't really live record my games just because of matchmaking time and we ended up finishing at like 3 a.m or something and like Ash was sleeping like I didn't want to wake her up, so uh, we're just going to be going over the games, the final three or four games, and just going to be going through our comp, and I think they're on Junk Park, maybe I can mix in some Hot Zone too, but uh, yeah, let's get into the games guys. Guys, right, so our first game is going to be on Controller Chaos Hot Zone, I cannot say before this push that I played a lot of this map, but uh, when you have Dynamite, B, and Daryl, you got to improvise, like a lot of our push we did on maps where we should not be able to play these brawlers and somehow it worked out um so also one thing to note is you can't tell in replays but we had delay we have delay pretty much every single game at this point it's very rare for us to play an na team i noticed uh i guess eu teams just typically push higher or there's more of them pushing higher i don't know so we played like a lot of russian teams like a lot of eu teams and uh you know it wasn't the most fun honestly but uh, you can just see, like, with our comp, I don't think it's really the best on any map, but I do think you can kind of get away with it. Like, uh, P uh, like okay, Pika's obviously really good at tanks, but I also think Daryl's just arguably, like, the best brawler, like, with Grom right now, in my opinion. You can play them both anywhere. Uh, so it's definitely nice that we had, like, one super broken brawler on our push. These guys, they just kind of gave up. Uh, and Lugi, he's just cracked at Dynamite. And B, I think it's pretty decent, like, everywhere. So it's kind of how our comp worked. <laughs> Alright, so here we have another EU team. I remember this game. We, we uh, did have delay. And, uh, yeah, they're going to be playing Double Thrower. Uh, Dynamite's actually really good on Junk Park. It's uh, probably his best map in the game, in my opinion. So <laughs> you can just see, like... Obviously, even with delay, I should hit that shot, but I'm blaming delay for that one. Uh, and pretty much our goal in Siege every time was me and Luki go the side with the first bot because of the Dynastun, and we can just melt it. And uh, Pika just goes weak side. He's Daryl. He can, like, outplay it sometimes. Uh, but, you know, we'll usually just hard win one side, and then Pika manages to win his lane somehow, too. So that was pretty much our strat for every Siege, and Siege was definitely my favorite mode, personally, to push in. I think we probably had our highest win rate in Siege too. Um, we also did a lot of like heist, uh, which you can tell with our copy makes sense. So a lot of heist, and yeah, we're just gonna one push actually, I think. So we do a ton of damage when we get on safe. I think Pika hit like a 6k almost there. Uh, so that safe just goes like right down really fast. So yeah, just uh, due to the amount of damage that Dynamite and uh, Daryl can do in a short amount of time, a lot of our siege games and heists were pretty much one pushes. In heist, I would just sit back on defense. Uh, I'd let them do everything. Obviously, like if I can get my 3k off on the save, yeah, that's cool. But uh, you know, B, uh, it doesn't have the most consistent damage. I think it's like 2% per shot, unless it's like a charge shot. So you can see I dropped my gadget there just to block uh, the squeak super. So it's important. My job in a lot of these games is just protect Luki at all costs. Like get Luki to the safe and uh you know you can see they're just really out of position so this game's kind of over they don't really have anyone for defense i don't know what their positioning was but they look kind of lost and we're gonna do another one push all right guys so this is gonna be the final game of our push and you can just see we're all excited spamming our uh angry primo so this one's actually na i'm pretty sure i recognize scorpion um but triple thrower it's kind of a rough one for me and honestly triple thrower is not the worst on this map so i'm gonna get the slow up and lucky's gonna be able to just uh clip him there as well but we already secured first bot so uh, it's looking pretty good i just i want to kill the sprout here if i can because if we can get rid of that wall uh it just kind of ruins their defense and he probably has gadget so he's just gonna get his wall up right okay yeah uh, they waited a long time, but I guess it worked out with the barley slow as well. 
So we're not going to one push here. It's really hard to with uh, Sprout defense. I think Luki does go down. Yeah, he uh, got a little too excited there. He wanted the 2k. <laughs> uh, so I'm just going to try holding them off. Obviously, if they ever do get a bot, they could one push very easily with their comp, I think, if we mess up on defense at all, just because it's a lot of damage, guys. Um, but, you know, it's looking like we're going to secure the second bot, and we did manage to get it to 50 so we're gonna look to finish here hopefully and uh yeah it's just protect luki at all cost time guys so i want to make sure he gets to the safe but i think he gets a little too excited here and i don't remember it exactly but i'm pretty sure he just jumps over and uh yeah he's yeah <laughs> so we're not gonna end there unfortunately uh it was a good try just trying to get the 2k in style at least but I realize like we can still lose, so I'm just kind of hanging back and just making sure uh, we don't because I don't want to play anymore, bro. Like I'm so tired at this point. It's like 3 a.m. Like been sitting in matchmaking for so long. Like I just want it to be over with. And uh, like he's gonna get Dynadiff there by Scorpion. Uh, but I think Pika, they're just out of position, so Pika is gonna manage to secure two bolts there, and they're gonna pick it up just too late. You can see how close that was, so we're, we're just partying right now, we're like, yeah, no more like 30 minute MM, uh, and yeah, that's why, it's not VM, it's more like excitement, and uh, just like, oh, thank you for this push being over, I never want to sit in matchmaking again, um, so yeah, you can just see we're excited shooting each other, Pika's uh, spinning very fast, and yeah, that's going to be the final game of our 2k push. So, like I said, guys, ideally, I could have done more content on this. I just, it was really tough with matchmaking, and I know I did it before, but, um, I just, uh, didn't really, like, enjoy streaming with this matchmaking as much this time, and, uh, it was just, like, we would push really late at night to, like, 5 a.m., and, like, just, I'd be, like, laying in bed, so I'm, like, I don't want to make a YouTube video at, like, 5 a.m., like, I just want, like, to beat some Russians, like get my trophies and like log off for the night. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I might do one or two more videos with the 2KB, but just wanted to deliver on my to deliver on my promise, you guys. There it is, the 2KB, and uh, yeah, I'll start making more videos now that I enjoy. I'm thinking like some rank 35s. I don't know if you guys still like those or not. If you guys have any video ideas, just uh, drop in the comments, and I'm open to anything besides 2k or 3k pushes. So yeah guys, appreciate you watching the video and I'll see you all soon. Peace.